I saw it. It was watching me. Yeah, right, Ash. You know you can't scare me. You shouldn't be down here. You better leave before our dad gets home. Oh Sir, God, no! Sir. No! Don't be afraid. I'm not gonna hurt you. What are you? I've been here a long time, I think. I want to leave, but I can't. Why? Please, can you come here and help me? This has to be unlocked. You're one of them, aren't you? What? The ones that put me here? I've been waiting for this. Now is my turn. Yeah. Oh my God. Like I'm going to hell for sneaking out with my... my friends. What do you and your friends do when you sneak out? Nothing. <laughs> wow, okay. I thought you were on my side, Doc. Do you understand the term white privilege or rich privilege? Oh, so you think I'm privileged because I'm white and my parents have money, right? As if. My dad got pulled over last month for your information. You young lady have blinderitis and a chronic case of the me, 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 me's. How long do I have, Doc? You're not gonna be one of those teens who has their whole life changed. By driving? The average British driver kisses 720 times in their life while operating your car. You think you're safe out on the roads? That cannot possibly be the case. But fine, you got me. I won't drive in England then. Ever since we trashed their tea, the British have been climbing over each other to get here. I'm pretty sure there hasn't been a 250 year tea shortage. You know it's been our legal right for 250 years. I can't wait to find out. Arming your own car in self-defense in case it becomes necessary. It's our right to own an armored car or- To arm your own car. It is against the law to attach a flamethrower to- In what circumstances, you pyro? Self-defense or convenience, either one is our right. I just want to drive, Mom. 